You can see why they called this Masters of the Universe revelation because it was unknowingly surprising how disappointing this was. On the one hand, you have all the great things that spark my serotonin like the witty one-liners and the corny little monologuing scenes. You know, the corny little nostalgic things we tend to love from the original series. This show is very aware that it's clowning on those original tropes and there's nothing wrong with that. It's actually pretty funny in my opinion. I like that type of stuff. But if we're going to talk about this, let's talk about the elephant in the room. In my honest opinion, it is really wild how disrespectful they were were with hitting us with the bait and switch when it came down to the show. Don't even hit me with the BS talking about this is a Masters of the Universe title because of the fact that Masters of the Universe is a He-Man production period. There should be absolutely no reason that the entirety of this marketing for this show was presented as He-Man. There should be no reason that the poster boy of the entire series and the primary protagonist is used as a cameo and supporting character in his own series. 